Well, folks in Norwich are rolling up their sleeves to bring a historic trolley system back to life. Today's Tina Detail shares how volunteers are giving back to that city. A green initiative takes shape in the Rose City. 20 Norwich businesses helped build this trolley to provide a free ride for tourism and commerce opportunities. This is obviously the, the seat for the driver of the trolley. This is the front end uh, and you can see part of the chassis down here. Volunteers built the body while the chassis was donated by American Ambulance. It came from one of these Ford E350 ambulances. We've been here in the city for 40 years. Um, I think it would be a great addition to see it driving around the, the city from the transportation center and down to the downtown area, bringing um, people that come into the city of Norwich. And Volunteers converted the diesel-powered chassis to an electric vehicle. The batteries will be underneath in the back, and it's actually a rack of batteries that you can pull out and then stick another rack in that's fully charged, and that way they can keep running the trolley while that other set of batteries is being charged. A project two and a half years in the making. More volunteers are still needed to put on the finishing touches up here and under the hood. The two volunteers they really need now are a TIG welder who will help install the drivetrain and the new motor they'll be getting. They also need an electrical engineer to help design this battery operated system. Students are welcome. Volunteering could turn into jobs with the company built around this project, Green Electric Technologies. This trolley will be donated to the city May 23rd. It's a free trolley. You'll be able to hop right on and get around downtown. Just in time for the Memorial Day weekend. In Norwich, Tina Detel, News 8.